Well, good morning. Well, it's almost noon. I've been a little busy this morning doing a few things. Uh, I was originally going to talk about adversity today, but uh, because of personal reasons, we're going to work on uh, patience because mine have been very tested this morning on just little stuff. So we're going to discuss patience and hopefully work through it pretty good. Sometimes people will get on your nerves. They'll do things that you know that you can't understand or just purposely try to get at you um, for whatever their reason is. Everybody has reasons for things they do. Sometimes people do stuff on purpose just to get to you. And the thing that I've learned, I mean, like, my patience was really tested this morning on a few different levels with a certain individual. You can't break anonymity, so the gentleman did shit purposely just to piss me off after I'd asked him nicely not to. And that's as far as I'll go with it, but uh, I wanted to slap the fucking fire out of him. I really did. And that's not my character. That's not the type of stuff I do. So, to calm myself down and bring myself back to a level to where I could manage and do things properly, I had to sit back and deep breathe. Also, I decided to do some music therapy. Yep, you guessed it. Slipknot therapy. I don't know, if you like that type of music, that's the best way to bring yourself back to center. Me, myself, I play guitar, so playing along with a few of these songs brought me back to a calming area. I played about four or five, and, uh, you know, I, I feel so much better now. Uh, music therapy is like a... A, a good calming effect to me. It brings me back to my core. And that's the object of being patient. Um, it's accepting things that are meant to throw you off. That's a huge thing with patience. Uh, deep breath. Evaluate the situation. Is it worth getting upset over? Is it worth listening to what others say about you when when it comes to that i have a thing that i've really used a lot in my life when people talk bad about me i just think that you know what i own that much of their mind i don't rent space in people's heads i own it and that's that changes things up for me i own it i don't rent nothing Let's just say you got somebody who's doing something just to purposely make you mad. The best act of patience is to not let it show that it bothers you. That's the best revenge you could have. But at the same time, you're exercising patience. Breathe deep. Breathe in everything they're trying to throw at you. And it's not your action that counts, it's your reaction. That's a huge thing. And if you don't grow, then you need to go. That's another huge thing that I've learned the last couple days. Growth is, is everything. And the more patient you are, the more growth you have. Kinda it. I mean, I don't really have much more to share with you about that, you know? Patience is a virtue, and a lot of us don't have it, especially in this time and age where we want what we want when we want it. And many of us fail to realize that, you know, anything good takes time. And 
when we do get the so-called what we want, we're never happy with it. So exercise patience and and wait for that, that good thing to come. Because it will come. You just have to be waiting for it and ready for it when it does come.